What's up guys? Welcome to Grease Lightning Reactions. We're here for ReZero, episode 8. Right at the beginning, a little past the opening title, you know, the TV Tokyo and all that stuff. At 11 seconds. 3, 2, 1, go. Oh yeah, he killed himself last time. And he's waking up again! Oh, where's the subtitles? There it is. He's calm this time. He's having trouble keeping it together. Yeah, how about that. <laughs> They're so confused by all this. You gotta trust them after. He says such weird things and she just brushes it off. Opening. It's going to be interesting to see exactly what happens because in this situation they have both the, the maids, Rem and uh, Ram. Ram? Rem? Rem, 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 Rem. Right? Am I getting it wrong? Both the maids have already probably uh, smelled the scent of the the witch on him. So they've already probably made some sort of guess as to... I mean, not guess. Um, but the first impression is already set, and that's not going to pretty much change. Um, right now, they're only... It's pretty much an act. Um being friendly to the person because they have to, you know, they're guests, um, at least for a little while until they get a real feel for what this kind of person, but they pretty much, I'm pretty sure they think that he is already dangerous. So it'll be interesting to see how he changes it this time because last time he changed one thing, but something else happened. So it's not like you change one thing, you're always going to get the positive outcome. Um, there's butterfly effect, there are different paths that can be taken, or maybe there's there's no way to find a path that is perfect. So, we'll see. Yeah, he doesn't want to be a freeloader right now. He was like weirdly passive aggressive. She talking to the spirits. Just spirit user. Spirit arts. That seems like it's better. It's 
be it for MP. Hmm. I bet it's going to be something stupid. None of them. Shadow! Shadow's cool. So we got Yin. Debuffs, yeah, that's usually what it is. You're gonna blind him. Is it reminding him of that one feeling? He was about to freak out. Yeah, do it. You might need it. The fuck? Well, yeah. He's probably tired from using mana. This will probably make her like him even more. I'm on the recharge. Was it an elixir? Boku no me. That's a good perspective to have. Naramu. Same scene this time. Shouldn't be saying stuff like that out loud, that makes it sound bad. My favorite person in the house.
Only one witch. The jealous one? Yep. Saw tell him, man. Seven deadly sins. Eight, six of them? It is sad. Those are probably rumors. Must be some. Even Puck was like, what a choice. What? He hasn't been doing anything. This man is so freaking strange. Oh god. Why? How can you tell? Yeah, you should. <laughs> what are you doing? I wear himself out. Oh God! Look at that face! Yeah, he's... What the hell is going on? He 
he is this build up She's scared. You can't have him rest. Do you have a meditate? Calm down? On the lap? They can all tell. Is he about to break down? He's being console this. Though that's broken. Why him of all people? Damn. He definitely, definitely needed that. What is she thinking right now? Did that change your mind? Maybe that will.
<laughs> Bear Cola? She doesn't like it. <laughs> I really like how she talks for some reason. Can you teach? He's going to be learning now. Oh. Oh, shit. One of them? What if it's someone in the mansion? What if it was... What was her name? Leah? His lover? That'd be intense, but... Or Betty herself? Slap! Oh! the lap pillow good music thanks there you go Oh yeah, they're pretty. I cried, crab hellings and stuff crying. Damn. Oops. We don't want to go on to Sakamoto right now. All right. All in all, pretty chill episode. Um, I was wondering if all this acting was gonna get up to, you know, catch up to him because, you know, he usually is a very very jokey person, but he was sounding starting to sound really desperate, really really weird, even weirder than usual. And, as we saw, he completely broke down, and he needed that cry. I've never seen someone excite themselves, like, force themselves to be excited to freaking vomiting, but that's what happened. And, uh, now it seems like, through the things that he just did, it seems like he is, at least, he has Ram's, uh trust I think Rem is getting there I don't think she's exactly there yet um, and I'm I I don't think he's really even been with the owner of the mansion much Roswald was it was that his name Roswald um, but now he has this theory about going to the village and I feel like 
it, the person being in the village, that'd be like, like it, it, it would almost be like a random person. If that person, if there's some like, you know, like some real good connection between the characters, then that's fantastic. But otherwise, if it's just some random dude, it's not as like, um, what's the word I'm looking for? doesn't cut as deep let's just say that um though the pool of characters to choose from if it is from the mansion is actually too small um they did get me before last time i did not think it was rem um and there's only a few other people that are left and the only one that i'd be surprised would be uh leah is it i keep thinking that's not her name but i think it is if it's her i would be kind of surprised but that's my guess right now um and yeah otherwise a uh, pretty good episode. I'm hoping next time we get a little further into, you know, figuring out who was the one who cursed him. And uh, let's see how far he gets along. Luckily, he was able to revive. Not that I had any doubt that he would. But you can obviously see why his paranoia was getting to him. Because, you know, this is definitely something he doesn't completely understand. So he should be cautious. Alright, if you guys enjoyed this reaction, please like and subscribe. And as always, thank you for watching. See you guys next time.